WFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trading up 81. NASDAQ is down four. S&P's off three. Gold. Gold contract down $23, trading at $19.25 an ounce. We have silver down 34 cents, $24.78 an ounce. Light sweet crude off 70 cents, $99.51 a barrel. Notes and bonds. The 10-year note down 20 ticks, trading 122.07. 30-year off eight at 149.46 in King Dollar. King dollar is up 315 ticks, trading 98.627. Euro is at 110. Yen's at 122.61. The British pound is at uh, one, where are you? GP, 131 to one US dollar. We get over and take a look at the S&P. What you have out here, folks, is this. So picture, you get January, uh, April 1st, bottom line, you get window dressing out here, barely up. That shows quite a bit how, just how weak this market is. We take a look at the SPY, forget the ABC structure up on the SPY on the NDX 100, folks. Bottom line, I suspect you're gonna get a failure. If you take a look at these on the weekly now, what you're gonna see is this. What you did is you went into the last swing points, you failed on price, you failed on volume in the weeklies, more than likely you get a monster ABC structure down uh, in this market. You know, so bottom line, the dates you wanna keep your eye on now are gonna be March uh, 5th. That March 5th level uh, is game uh, inside the indices. If we take up the NDX 100, we take a look at the three Qs. Same setup inside the three Qs. What do you have here? You're down a buck and a half right now. You put this uh, on a weekly, you're gonna see it's pretty clear on a weekly. Uh, you basically you know, got into the swing point, you failed on price, you're gonna fail on volume. And if this is an ABC down, it actually lines up right to the next high volume low, which is 297. The last time down, we got to uh, 318. Man, 297's game. So it's going to be wild watching this baby shake out. No doubt, man. I mean, he had, he had a huge counter trend bounce. I suspect that counter trend bounce is over. It's also lining up, you know, just calendar wise. You know, remember when we were saying first that this the bounce is going to happen? You, you run right up into window dressing. You know, that's it. And normally, window dressing can take a couple more days, but the bottom line, it's there. Inside of window dressing, this is what I suspected. I was on the TD network the other day and I was talking about this. I suspected the funds would start getting into the gold equities. It's exactly what they're doing. You can see gold's down 25 bucks. Bottom line, take a look at Newmont, take a look at uh, Rango Resources. They're buying it all hand over fist, folks. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.